Hi everyone, it's me, Rosie. Happy 2009. Today we're going to get physical, physical. Okay, anyway, uh, Weight Watchers Momentum Program really encourages for you to exercise on a regular basis, and if you're like me, you don't. So, I am planning to make a exercise video once a month with different exercises, and I'm working toward working out at least five days a week for 30 minutes. That's my starting goal right now. Okay, so why don't we get a little physical now? Go put your workout clothes and meet me back here. Welcome back. So for most of us who are not exercising, our excuse is usually we're too busy, we don't have time, this or that, blah, blah, blah. So today, the exercises I'm going to be demonstrating can be done at the office. You don't need any special equipment other than a chair, a coffee mug, and a water bottle. I have two here so I can demonstrate. You could start off with a small filled water bottle, and you're going to use it as a weight. And when you're ready, you can upgrade to a bigger one. Okay, that's all you need. Coffee mug, water bottle, and a chair. You got that? Okay, let's get started. Okay, the first exercise we're going to do are wrist stretches. Alright, we're going to start with the left and then move to the right. You place your left hand in front of you with your palm out. Your right hand, you're going to reach and put it right on the fingers and pull back. See? Pulling back like that. Alright, you're going to hold this for about 20 to 30 seconds. Okay, we're going to pretend that was 20 or 30 seconds. Release it and repeat with the right side. Okay, we're going to pretend that was 20 seconds. All right, so that's the first exercise, the wrist stretch. The second exercise are the wrist and forearm stretch. So you're going to bring your arms up and your hands up like you're praying. Open up your elbows like a butterfly and press left, right, left, right. You're going to do 10 reps of this and what you should be stretching are your wrists and your forearms. And I can definitely feel it. The third exercise is a low back stretch. So we're going to start with the left side, then move over to the right. First thing is, you get your left hand, and place it on your left hip. You get your right hand, place it over to your left thigh, and stretch. You want to hold that for 20 to 30 seconds, and release, and do it all over again on the right side. Right hand on your hip, left hand on your thigh, and stretch or twist. And you want to hold that for 20 or 30 seconds. After that, you release and we move on to exercise four. The next three exercises, four, five, and six, are going to be lower body exercises. And we're going to start with hip flexation. So you want to just sit up tall on your chair, feet on the ground. I wish you could see them, but feet on the ground. And lift up, 
starting with the left leg as high as you can, using your hip, and hold for about 10 seconds, or 20, or 30, or as long as you can, comfortably. And release. Then you want to do that with your right. You might want to start with 10, move on to 20, 30, and so on. I definitely feel it all in here. Okay, that's the first of the lower body, the fourth exercise in total. Now for the fifth exercise, leg extensions. They're similar to hip flexations, but what you're going to do is, again, sit tall and basically just lift out your leg. Uh oh, you heard my knee pop. So you're just sitting down, lift, hold for 20 or 30 seconds and release. Lift, hold, holding your leg straight out 20 to 30 seconds and release. 